Jasmine Pais facing criminal charges for allegedly trying to hire someone for $3,000 to kill her young child. She's 18. She went on a website to hire a hitman. Kill her three-year-old son. What? To kill her own child? That website is rentahitman.com. Robert Inez created it for a cybersecurity project, but over the years it received criminal solicitations. This week it was allegedly from Pais. The ability to research names and addresses and and verify that uh, uh, the intended target lived at a particular address, um, you know, th that to me is a red flag. I mean, if that information is corroborated, then obviously there's something more that needs to be looked at. And that's why I referred it. Bias allegedly explained in an online form she wanted a hitman to get something done once and for all, adding she wanted the boy taken away far, far away and possibly killed by Thursday. Bias allegedly sent recent pictures of what the baby looked like, and out of the thousands of requests Robert gets a day, he knew this one was real because of how specific she was. He called police, but apparently Miami-Dade didn't believe him at first. They were not interested. They sent me an email saying that, hey, if I contacted him one more time, they were going to send me a cease and desist letter. <laughs> Eventually, a detective was put on the case. The officer texted Bias, acting like the hitman, and she allegedly agreed to pay him $3,000 for the job. The woman was later arrested, and she allegedly confessed. No contact with this child, either directly, indirectly, in person, in writing, by telephone, or through third parties. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.